welcome back for some more Jojo's Bizarre Adventures. So we are in Diamond is Unbreakable, but we are at episode four and guys, ah, I'm not gonna lie. For a second, I didn't remember what happened in the last episode. And then I checked the thumbnail that I did and I was like, oh, this happened, yeah. And now I am just so freaking excited because obviously you guys know that in the last episode, we've got uh Josuke's friend which obviously I don't remember the name that's what I was searching for uh he's he got an arrow in the throat in the throat and um Josuke was about to save him but then he got uh obviously stopped by another stand user which is the end and his stand seems so freaking powerful because obviously he can freaking make things like disappear or shrunk i think he uh, he was saying and yo this is ah this is incredible and um i'm not gonna lie I, i'm not gonna lie i don't know what will happen to his friend because right now the dude with the arrow and the bow just took him and bring him in and bring him inside the home so i guess what will be happening so theory time uh, not just okay. Jotaro will come. He will probably get rid of the the hand because the hand, even so, he's powerful. He doesn't know what to do with his power. You know what I mean? Like it's a it's a new stand. He's a new stand user, so he doesn't know how to use it that well. So Jotaro will get rid of him, or maybe just okay. But I'm pretty sure Jotaro will come in you know, the scene, and they will go and try to help Jessica's friend. And I think they will be able to help him. The question is, will his friend survive? And if he does, what stand will he have? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, guys. Uh, but before we get started, I just wanted to say a big thank you to my Patreons. Thank you guys so much for your trust and your support over this platform. And if you want to join us over there, I am currently watching Gintama Dragon Ball. I am uploading the full reaction of my YouTube content. With that, I do early releases of Jojo's Bizarre Adventure and Black Clover. So if you want to join, the link is in my description box. And without further ado, guys, let's just get started. Okay, this is an horrible sight and I didn't remember that Josuke took care of the end. Oh my god, I feel so bad, guys. Uh, but if he does, ah, I was like, my god, <laughs> it's like even more disgusting. Oh, yeah, with the flower pot. My god, I totally forgot. I'm sorry, guys. Like, okay, my dude, you're good to just, you know, pew, throw arrows and throw people, but are you good to fight, though? Oh, my god. Because I'm pretty sure he's not that good at fighting. Ooh la 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 la. That must have hurt like a bit. My worst company? What does that mean? Is that the name of his stand? Exactly. Okay, you know what? I'm pretty sure that because he's ditching him right now, he will become kind. Or he will work at least with him. Because he would want to get revenge. Okay, man, the turn out of event. I would have never guessed that he would save him. Oh my god, and that uh, his little brother, Koichi, that's it. Uh, wow, okay, yeah, the, in the end, I just wanted to say that I would have never guessed this would have happened. Yeah, I can't wait for you to meet uh, Jotaro, man, I can't wait. I knew it. <laughs> I was like, I'm sure he won't kill him. But I'm pretty sure Josuke will be the first person to be kind to him. 
So he'll help. Oh my my. He's got such a sweet heart. Oh. And you know what? In the end, I'm pretty sure that the bow and the arrow are not his stand. Because it was the old lady's stand before. I'm pretty sure he's just using it because of the power. But his stand is the thing that made old. And this is true. Like, he attacked Josuke, like, without having any real motive. He was doing it because his older brother was asking him to do so. So I kind of agree with the fact that he didn't want, like, he didn't see any reason for him to die. Because deep down, he, he's not a bad person. I'm sure of it. Oh my god! I almost had a heart attack! Oh my god! Because he can't use it on himself. You know, I thought about it for a second and then I remember what he said in the last episode. That's it. <laughs> At this point, this is just screaming. This is a trap. This is a trap. This is a trap. Ah! Even if I know it's a trap. Oh. Uh. Ooh! No, he'll help him. my god did it just shrunk the distance between those two? Oh my god guys this is amazing so it didn't get trapped oh but where is the other dude So maybe in the end he won't have any stand because he repaired him, you know? Wait a second! Was that little freaking figurines like soldiers? Oh my god! So those bullets were ah! His stand is like having little freaking People like shooting? Oh my god! Except the things that he doesn't know is that there's a tons of those little <laughs> soldiers! La la, my my. How many does he have? <laughs> Every time I'm thinking like there, it like it's impossible for like another amazing stand to just appear, you know. But dang, it did. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is so great! Oh la la! Oh moly! Is there a window in that room? Like, just get out by the window. There must be a window. There's no window open. Perfect. Don't tell me the tanks are are outside too, please. Oh no! <laughs> oh fuck! That is so great. Wait a freaking second! This is so right. He knew. Ah! Oh, he has a stand. Oh my god! But what? What? What is this stand? Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> this is so great! Ah, oh, don't tell me it will be 
forced to listen to him. I wonder if Koichi has a, you know, kind of hum humanoid stand, kind of the word the end or, you know, just a stand. Or will it be something completely different that we never saw before? I wonder if the ability that he is looking for is something like the word, so the fact that he can stop time. <laughs> like, poor little boy, he, like, he just knew a freaking couple of seconds ago that he's a stand user, but he doesn't know how to use it. What? Oh my god, this dude. I doesn't know how this works. You know, since he's kind of really smart, I'm pretty sure it's much more of a stand that would be like on the defensive and just smart side. Stand or what? What the fuck? <laughs> Don't tell me his stand can just counter every stand that you know the enemy is using. I wonder if by attacking Josuke. Koichi will feel like he needs to defend him and that's how his stand will just woo, pop out, you know? Oh! He's doing it! He's doing it! Let's go! Let's go, Koichi! No, I'm pretty sure he's feeling him. <laughs> oh, no. Ah, of course. <laughs> You have to be freaking kidding me! The landmine, what? Oh la la! His arm. Oh my god, Koichi, you need to do something, but he's probably unconscious at this point. <laughs> I can't. Hit. That point of view is so great. Did he saw? Did he saw that Koichi is using a stand right now and that's why he's so relaxed? Or did he saw something we didn't? Wait, what? Oh! <laughs> he freaking reconstructed them. Oh, this is good. Thank you friends so obviously that was it for today's episode of jojo's bizarre adventure and man oh man i am loving this part for so much right now every episode we've watched and kind of remind it, it kind of reminded me of part three because i loved part three so much too but ah so many questions right now what is koichi's um you know stand what will the little brother, which obviously I don't know the name, will do? And where is freaking Jotaro? Like, he never came. I was so sure he would, like, he would come and save the day. But in the end, Jessica is just so smart that he just made up a plan on his own while he was fighting. So this is incredible. So, yeah, but with that, mm, uh, I have so many, well, not that much, but... You know, I will have probably some theories for the next episode because so many things can happen at this point. And I just really wonder if that dude that just... I'm pretty sure he's dead or at least is pretty uh, injured. You know, I, I, I thought two episodes ago that he would be the one that tried to, you know, take Dio's place. But obviously he wasn't at his level. 
So yeah, the question is why? What, what was he looking for? What stand was he looking for? And I'm pretty sure he's not the boss. I'm pretty sure there's someone, you know, higher than him. So, so many things, so many things, guys. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more anime content. And we will see each other in my next video. Bye-bye.